Hello everybody and welcome back to the channel. I'm Jake, aka the Kentucky Dipper. We're coming at you again with another video today. Um, breaking into the first uh, entry into the Dip Accessories pl uh, playlist. And this is going to be a video where we talk, review and discuss mud jug ladies and gentlemen that's right as you can see we got ourselves a black mud jug here pretty it's just the basic classic style spittoon um but before we review this of course we're gonna have to throw in a dip so if you got something to dip and you feel like throwing in a lip with me, pack one up and throw one in. Now is the time. We got some Stoker straight. You know how we roll here. We love the Stokers. Go ahead and, gosh, if I don't take the whole can in one pinch. Cheers, ladies and gentlemen. Mm-hmm. So, basically, the mud jug, for a very long time now, has been the talk of the town when it comes to dip, you know. This is, I mean, there's one point where, I mean, I, I can remember actually getting, like, lightweight shamed for spitting in a bottle and not getting a mud jug but i had one of these back in the day same exact one back in the high school days and immediately the first thing i noticed with uh there is a difference okay the one i had back in the day as you can see they add this little lip there they used to not be there and I feel like it was a lot more difficult to get the funnel off. Like, it took some more force. And I feel like it just doesn't really feel the same. Like, it used to... I feel like it used to snap into place a lot better. Now it kind of comes off... I mean, it seems easier to me. And I mean, I have dropped this thing once didn't spill as you can see it does not spill there is spit in this mud jug so you know and also it, it does help conceal the smell of this dip spit too it is definitely a nice item to have okay Overall, um, this is a product that feels great in your hand. Um, either, you know, you can kind of cup, you can hold it, bring it to you, you can hold it underneath, and it's it's got a nice weight to it. I mean, it just, it feels good in the hand. But... It's not very um, discreet. Like, it's pretty big. Um, people, I mean, it is kind of like, it's one of those things where, I don't know, I feel like people would see it and they'd question, what is that thing? What is that? You know, but it's also weighted, so it does kind of do the weeble wobble kind of thing you know weebles wobble but they don't fall down well mud jugs also wobble and they don't tip over and spill i mean you can knock this thing off of a shelf chuck it across the parking lot it's still gonna land right back up on its side like that 
so ingenuity wise these are great and they also make the uh other types like the roadie the stealth um and such which help with the uh more discreet thing i was mentioning so if you wanted to be a little more discreet um the stealth or the roadie is probably going to be the one for you um people also um i feel like go for the roadies because they drive i just went with the classic because it's still it still will sit in the cup holder nice and not really it might wobble around but it ain't going nowhere and, and it ain't gonna spill so all in all it's a great product don't get me wrong it is a fantastic product and if you're you know trying to be more clean and efficient about your dipping i highly would suggest getting a mud jug y'all they're great products um pretty relatively affordable uh, unless you start getting the uh the dipped ones those can be a little more pricey but you know 20 bucks you know you can get you just a basic mud jug so they are affordable i'm pretty sure boot barn carries them too um but yeah so you might be able to find them at the boot barn other than that you got to go through their website mudjug.com sometimes if you uh if you follow some of those guys uh like chris dips one those guys they will sometimes give out free ones give out promos it just depends usually they have different deals going on at, you know holiday season right now big time of the year for mud jug so that being said check them out and we'll go ahead and review it on our scale of one to ten now it is like i said feels great in the hand looks good it's got the weight so it doesn't spill it is spill proof smell proof the only drawback i do not like is the new funnel woods and i know that sounds really nitpicky but i just don't know if i'm a fan of that lip on there i feel like it was a lot more it felt a lot more quality with the old style funnel for some reason um don't know why but that's just what i think so i am going to give it a nine because all around it's made in florida so it's made in the usa always like to support things that are made in the usa uh and it's just overall they have great products you can't go wrong you can't really uh yeah i mean it's just a good overall product so it's not it's not going to get a terrible review on my channel uh i've always liked mud jugs this particular style of mud jug it really brings back memories man because i spent a lot of good memories good times uh passing around the old black mud jug back in the day between all my high school friends i know that sounds disgusting but yeah you know mud jugs were a big deal to us back in the high school days and usually there was only one or two of us that actually had one i used to be one of them and i had the black one but yeah great product uh highly recommend you check them out if you enjoyed this review y'all and you want to see more content like this we will probably get some more dip accessories in the future but be sure to leave a like on this video everybody support the channel helps uh get this channel out there as much as possible and uh of course subscribe 
That way you can be up to date with all future content I post here on the channel. Um, with that being said, y'all, my name is Jake, a.k.a. the Kentucky Dipper. I appreciate y'all watching, dipping along, and supporting my channel. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Thank you. Be safe.